Welcome back here to Early Texas Today. Your time now is 4.50. And while a lot of us may be still tired from daylight saving time, well, there is people still celebrating in Hollywood this morning because the 96th Academy Awards happened last night and it sure was a special ceremony for one film in particular. NBC News recaps it all. Barbie may have raked it in at the box office, but it was Oppenheimer that was pure gold at the Oscars. And Maria, I see Oppenheimer. A three hour summer blockbuster about the making of the atomic bomb dominated the Academy Awards Sunday night, winning seven, including Best Picture. Could deny it, but I have been dreaming about this moment for so long. Producer Emma Thomas saw her husband, Christopher Nolan, win Best Director for the first time. There, there are so many people who, who dragged me up here. Including Robert Downey Jr., who won Best Supporting Actor. I'd like to thank my terrible childhood <laughs> and the Academy. As well as Killian Murphy, who earned Best Actor for Oppenheimer's title role. We made a film about the, the man who created the atomic bomb, and for better or for worse, we're all living in Oppenheimer's world, so I would really like to dedicate this to the peacemakers everywhere. The night's other winners included... And we're still. The Poor Things star was left a bit flustered as she took home a second Oscar as Best Actress. This is really overwhelming. Sorry, I. Mm, okay, and my voice is also a little gone. Whatever. And Davine Joy Randolph was overwhelmed with emotion in winning Best Supporting Actress for The Holdovers. But for so long, I've always wanted to be different. And now I realize I just need to be myself. And What Was I Made For gave Billie Eilish and brother Phineas their second Oscar for Best Original Song. It was Barbie's only win of the night. Jennifer Bjorklund, NBC News, Hollywood.